Come on! Come on! Feast your eyes upon the most marvelous martial magnificence that the Underdark has to offer. I, Baloth, the Entertainer, cordially invite you to join the audience of my latest spectacle. The Black. Hello everybody, my name is Card Gaming, and welcome to the Black Pits. I've been promising this for a while now, so I figured it was time to get into it. I've made a uh, pre-made team based on YouTubers, I know. This is not it. Let's delete all these. And I think I can import the... from saved game, maybe? Will that work? No, that's not it. I think I have to do it from character files. Luckily, I saved them all. Alright, here we go. We have the uh, characters at the ready. These are the people I'm going to use. First off, we have my... My dude right here, Card Gaming. I'm going to be a Berserker. A chaotic good one. I'm looking buff and bald as usual. And then, we have our friendly neighborhood YouTubers. First off, we have Dai. Which is a YouTuber I like. There's gonna be, like, um, links to all of their channels in this video, at least. So, check them out. They're pretty awesome. She's a mage! A chaotic neutral one! And then we have Dragast, a berserker. I think he might actually be a dwarven berserker, maybe? I mean, he's got a magnificent beard. But he might be human. I'm not sure. I made these, like, a while ago. Next up, we have Marion Stacy from Geek Remix. Mori is an archer, and Stace is a berserker. Was that it? Did I... Oh, we also have Adam Bomb over here. Who is a priest of Tear, Which is a, um, neutral cleric. That is gonna be our pre-made party. Let's invite them all and set those up. And there we go! The team is assembled! I'm gonna do a bit more in-depth on each character once we get in there. But, let's play. What? What? Where are we? Who oh, spiked me, drink? I was just in the tavern talking to Myrna. Hey, I saw those folks there too. We're in some kind of fighting pit. Look out! Monsters! That doesn't look very good. Three Tasloi versus three scrubs. Luckily, they... Oh, no. We weren't in time to uh, support them. That sucks for them. Now, because we are um, not imported, I think if you import like from a save, you can have some gear. Maybe? Or maybe not. You have a slave ring right here. Hmm. So I guess we um, start off with pretty much nothing. So it's gonna be a challenge to begin with. We have Kart. He is a orc berserker. We have Mari. She's a half orc uh, berserker as well. I like berserker, but I'm gonna... Put them in a bit of a different path soon. Then we have the half-orc berserker Dragast. Then we have the elven archer Mari, the uh, dwarven priest of Tear Adam, and the elven mage Dai. Now, I should probably try to pick this up. So everyone that needs a weapon has a weapon. You can probably make do with that. Who doesn't have a weapon? I mean, everyone has some sort of weapon, so let's just get into it. This shouldn't be much of a problem this first round. Because we outnumber them quite heavily. But we can also use some uh, spells. Let's use a spook spell. Why the heck not? Just to make things more manageable. And to make sure everyone has something to do. Do I want to loot these guys up here? I mean, they only seem to have, like, normal weapons. Okay, I shouldn't have feared him! He's running all over the place! Stand still and die! Don't be like that! Now, everyone is, like, level 1, right? Yeah. So it's gonna be a, a bit of a uh, challenge in the beginning. You have qualified. Thank you! Question mark! What's next? Ah, 
this group. Are they awake yet? Oh, rouse yourselves, you lice-laden layabouts. Stand and salute your new master, Baloth, the Entertainer. You may also thank me, since your meaningless lives are about to become infinitely more exciting and quite likely abbreviated. You have been brought here by an unlucky roll of the die. Well, unlucky for you. Gather some equipment, gird your loins, and prepare to fight. Nasheem, my obedient slave, take care of them. Do I really need to gird my loins? I mean, my loins are pretty damn girded already. And don't forget to give them a little spending money. Ooh, I like the sound of that. Give me money. As my master commands, take these coins. Speak with the dealers gathered here to equip yourselves. Once you are prepared, report to Master Bailoff. Do not attempt to escape, lest he command me to snuff out your life. Where are we? What's going on? I demand an explanation. You have been summoned to this island fortress by Bailoff. We are in a complex known as the Black Pits, dug by Durkar slaves. You are to fight in the battle pits for the amusement of Baylot's guests. I have answered your questions. Now, prepare for battle. I mean, he's probably not gonna listen to us if we try to uh, ally with him. So for now, I shall do as you ask. Prepare yourself for battle, mortal. When you are ready to face your fate, speak with Baylot. I don't like it, but I too feel the effects of this undying Gaius. One day. So these slave rings keep us kind of under his control, and that genius, well, maybe we can do something about that later on. Let's see, we didn't get anything, but we did get some gold to spend. Let's meet the gang. Devlin! What do... Oh, m more of your sort. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll get you whatever you need. My name is D -D 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 Devlin Terralom. I deal mainly in... Re Ranged weaponry. What can I get you? How did you come to be here, Elf? I'd... I'd b b better not waste time t talking to you. Baylos will r r <laughs> hurt me more. I am a slave to his will. P please don't bring me to his at attention. It's all right. I don't want to cause you any more trouble. F f forget I said anything. Please, j j Buy something before he c c comes over. I, I, I don't wish to annoy him further. He doesn't seem like a very charitable, charitable, uh, charitable or kind master. Let's see what he has for sale. I feel like at least Mari over here should use a uh, bow. Can I use a long bow? Is that fine? As a um, rogue, I think he is, right? Or an archer. That is a ranger or a... Spider. I think it's a ranger. As I said, there was a bit time ago before I... Uh, since I made these guys. Archer is the epitome... Yeah. May achieve grand mastery. Yeah, I think we're gonna do a long bow. Uh, it is a ranger kit. They don't have charm ability. Cool. Let's get her a long bow. And some arrows. Get yourself 200 arrows and a bit more. Three stacks of arrows. What? Yes, four stacks of arrows and we are ready to go. Do we want a sling for my spellcaster? Probably. Get one of those and maybe you too. And a few bullets for you. Let's see. Three, six each. I'm thinking, should do it, for now. There we go. Let's equip our dudes. And do that. Now, these missile weapons are quite powerful in the early game. Just less like they were in Bulge Gate. You fools have no idea what you're in for. You'd best arm yourselves as heavily as possible. I can help with that, if you've enough coin. Why do you look so grim? I mean, she's enslaved to a mad wizard. 
I find little cause for amusement since that Rao unleashed his monsters on us, which never would have worked if we had even one worthy man among us. Oh, you see, uh, talking crap about the dude next to her. I'm sure everyone resisted as well as possible. Did you come here for gossip or arms? For arms, of course. I mean, gossip, really. Now, show me what you have to sell. I would like... Let's see what points did I put everything in. For cart, I put things in two weapon style and long sword. For Stacy, I put it in two handed sword. And for Draygast, two weapon axes. So I should probably get some of those. What do you have? Play the Morning Star and Sling. Alright. Cart, I would like you to get. Hmm, we should maybe have enough gold to buy ourselves what we need. Get you a two-handed sword. Dre gets two battle axes. They are kind of cheap. And it might help to get you one. A flail, maybe. Or morning star. Morning stars are cheaper. Let's get that. Gotta be skimpy right here. Very, very cheap. There we go. Maybe get you that. Just in case. Now, Stacy actually got the best rolls of the dice when I was doing it. I think she got like a 95 or 96 out of 100. So she's actually our best rolled character, I think. But everyone is pretty good. I spent like hours rolling these guys. So... They better do the job. And then we need armor. Are you armor? Hi. What do your interlopers want? If it isn't a light weapon, then off with you. Come now. We're both in the same predicament. What's the harm in being friendly? Friendly? These usurpers walking intruders? Ha! If Bailoff hadn't taken over, my people and I would already have driven you out. What are your grave more likely? I doubt it. Bailoff may have captured me, but he enslaved you first. Let's be rude back. I'm no more a slave than you are. Maybe a little less. What do you mean a little less? I meant only that... Uh, never mind what I meant. You are as much an intruder as Bailoff. This territory belongs to my people. The Durga. Hmm. He might be a snitch, a rat for Bailoff. We not, might have to keep an eye on him. What do you have to, for sale? Oh, so you have the uh, light weapons. Cool. I don't think I need any of those, no? At least not yet. Day is coming soon. And then, Pelos shall pay. What's this? More useless captives for the Black Pits? Have you come to buy my scrolls? What do you have? Let's not get everyone's life story right here. But we might want to get some of these spells for die. So maybe get at least my favorite spell, Magic Missiles. 160. It's kind of expensive though. I feel like Color Spray might be great too. And the Fear spell. Sleep? Yes. Get those two. And that should be it. Actually, do you have anything else? Like, do you have a scroll case? Do I even need that? I probably don't. No. Greetings, surface dwellers. If it's potions you seek, then my friend can brew something special just for you. You may call me Balagulp. Your friend is a giant talking mushroom? He is not a mere mushroom, but a sentient being known as a Myconaid. I'm not surprised you haven't encountered one before. Most live in the lower reaches of the Underdark. That's where I met this charming fella. An unfortunate wrong turn led me into a deadly field of fungus. I would have died had the concoctor not arrived in time to save me with one of his marvelous elixirs. His name is the concoctor? No, his name is a brief sequence of spores that most people can barely detect, much less interpret. 
but we've wandered the underdog together so long that I can now translate his spore talk for others. His full name is closer to Keen Scent and Concocter of Marvelous Drafts, and even that's not his real name, which even I can't fully understand. Are you two the same people I met in Dragonspear? Under the, um, the keep right there? Dragonspear Castle? I think they might be. How did you end up here? After my friend rescued me, we wandered the Underdark for a while, searching for rare ingredients for his potions and valuable gems for me. Unfortunately, before we found much of either, Bayloth found us. The drow would have slain us both, but when he learned of the concocter's talent for potions, he brought us here to support his entertainment. Why haven't you and the other captives fought back? Oh, we tried, all right. As soon as he turned his back. But Bailoff has put some sort of charm on us that makes us obey. You probably failed its effects yourself. How can you break that enchantment? We can't. Not as far as I can tell. Only Bailoff's will, or maybe his death, can release us. Unfortunately, the same enchantment that keeps us from disobeying him also keeps us from fighting back. As if that would do any good with that powerful djinn by his side. In the meantime, can I help you find a potion? They're all still warm. I think we're good for now. So we got two things we need to do, or three rather. One, we need to survive, obviously. Second, we need to break that um, spell or gaius. Which I think is connected to these rings we have. Yeah. And third, we need to uh, free... Or deal with the uh, dr genie somehow. Oh, you're an illithid, right? Aren't you supposed to be able to put thoughts in my head or something like that? Telepathy? Telepathy? No. He doesn't want to. Now, what do you have? You probably have some magical stuff that I can't afford. But it might be good to check out the wares. Ring of the Princess, I want that. The Amplifier is for mages, right? Yeah. One extra second level spell. Alright, we'll keep that in mind. We might want to sell off whatever we can. Need those. We might want to learn those as well. Sleep is going to be very handy early game. I'm actually going to get that instead of Spook. Yes, more mortals to twist in agony upon the battlefield. <sighs> Were I not enjoying the sight so much, I would be tempted to step into the arena and eviscerate you myself. You don't seem to belong here. <sighs> Who are you to judge where I belong? <sighs> Baloth is one of my most valued customers. When he invited me here, I welcomed the opportunity to display my finely crafted magical garments to hundreds of spectators from across the realms. So you're not, not actually under the spell? Baloth would never cast such a spell on an honored guest. And why would I wish to leave? Baloth is known for his especially horrific tableaus. <laughs> His name is whispered in reverent tones by all who relish blood sport. Now, shall I begin fitting you for a burial shroud? Let's see what you have. So you got belts, robes. I mean, those are kind of expensive. I wonder if I can loot the dudes I fight in the arena. And you got boots and braces as well. Good to know. Scorch the armor. I probably want to get you. So, looking at the wares here, it seems like he has the heavy stuff and he has the lighter stuff. We probably want the heavy stuff first. You are Baylor's latest twerps, aren't you? Yeah. Well, I hope you can at least spit in his eye before you die. That last group, we should have bought more of my heavy armor. Has Baylor abducted you too? Abducted? This here is my home. Or at least it was. Until that confounded wizard slaughtered my clan after forcing us to dig out this blasted complex. You must want revenge. Vladogar will punish Baylor's in due time. Until then, 
His cruel spells prevent us from rebelling. Some days I wish he'd vaporize me along with the others. At least I wouldn't have to suffer this humiliation. Now, what do you want? I would like to gear out my melee fighters, thank you very much. What can we afford? We have 1904 gold at the ready. I probably want to get these three uh, kitted out. What should we... Um, I can't afford plate mail for everyone. But I can afford one plate mail and two splint mails. I think that's what we're gonna do. And we definitely want helmets to prevent critical attacks. Actually, four of those. Because... Uh, Adam can also use that. And Adam can also use a medium or a large shield. Yes. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I think that's gonna be good. And then we need leather armor for Mari. More placings for Belos. They dragged off the bodies of the last one just yesterday. I suppose you've wisely decided that being light on your feet is the only way to prolong your life? How many people has Bailoff summoned here? Dozens. Perhaps hundreds by now. I try not to become involved, since most don't survive long in the black pits. And I have no love for your kind. Rude! Now, can I sell you some light armor? Yes, you can! Let's see what you have. I probably want a studded leather for Mari. And... Oh, she can also wear a helmet. I'll take a helmet for her. And I think we're ready to get started with our conquering of the Black Pits. But before we do that... Uh, wait a minute. How many more did I need? Tell me I didn't buy one too many. I think I might have bought one splint mail too many. Poop. Well, I'll take it. Everyone seems to be ready for the first official round. However, that is going to be a tale of another day. I'm going to play through this the entire run. So let me know that you guys want to see more by hitting that thumbs up button, leaving a comment below and sharing the video around. Everything helps out to grow the channel, and I appreciate it. Thank you for watching, I'll see you guys next time.